Mackenzie critiques. Now Mackenzie bigs up your favorite anime. Dinner's ready. Gintama double. This is the Kain Tayak for episode 290 and 291. Dinner's ready. Grubs on the table. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. I was going to tell you guys something, but I don't think it's the right time to tell you guys. It's just a euphemism I use <laughs> for when my Hunter x Hunter reactions come out. But I'm not going to say it now because some of you guys, probably Hunter fans, might get triggered. So, uh, you if you follow me on Twitter, you'll, you know what euphemism I use for whenever my Hunter triple comes out. So, without further ado, let's get to this. Give time episode 290. Come on. Dun, 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 dun. This is Kiss Anime episodes. So remember, if you want to sync it one to one, do it with those. Star Trek. Nanki. Oh, sorry, Star Wars. What the hell happened to the animation here? Trevor's like the populace. There we go. Bag with fifty million. Oh, there's only bags that can have fifty million. Just a bunch of paper. Wow. He's talking about the fucking financial crisis, isn't it? <laughs> Lend you fifty million dollars. Nothing to turn profit. Aru. Wow, man. It says it for his fortune. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. Oh wow. Always leave enough room for fifty million in your bag. <laughs> Arbitrary number fifty million. Wow, what an intro. This is gonna be good man. Finally Sakamoto gets some flipping development, man. How long has he flipping been? It's only only been two hundred and ninety episodes before Sakamoto got any episodes, isn't it? Like, you know, you gotta see the criticisms for where they lie, man. We only had to wait 290 episodes, or however many chapters it took to get Sakamoto's. I think they're rectifying this before uh, so gonna, uh, SA arc. Dinner's ready! Double live reaction. I'm giving you a flipping three course meal here, fam. Actually, it's a double, two, two course meal. <laughs> Chico with Honeyworks, the song is called. My boy, Chiga Chiga. I can, I can, based on the title of the essay arc, I, I can already know, like, you can anticipate that some man is gonna get, you know, <laughs> taken the flip up. I don't know how I should feel about that right now, knowing that, but we'll see how it goes. I want to make sure that when that time comes, I do not leave a spoiler thumbnail for people to see. Can we have these? They won't even sell, man. <laughs> Audio cha. Audio is like otai, like the otai of this wherever he is. Uh. Oh shit, Kintobi.
<laughs> Saka mga odon na. By the time I first met him. Here we go. <laughs> Mistaken. <laughs> Cut to the hammer. Little rich boys. Oh shit. We Lego Rich. The boy the boy. Kentucky never had that luxury. He was an orphan, wasn't he? <laughs> Richie Rich. I like Archie comics. Yeah, man. I remember Archie comics. I got some. <laughs> Is he too? He's ignoring us. <laughs> Damn, man. Not like the Sakamoto now. <laughs> Too sick, isn't it? Or not with this one. trade, yeah. Yeah, he's the money, man, he's the money. I'm profit all products. <laughs> yeah, what's her deal? I think she's the more interesting question. We know zilch about her. <laughs> Suck up was a dog, man. His eyes were in the sky, to the skies. 
Oh shit. The Chidori Space Pirates. Chidori! <laughs> like. After the Harvest Summer. Intergalactic human trafficking, man. Huh? How did he become her leader though? You were the seller of the selling. Second division. Diamond Princess. Kicks <laughs> one piece. <laughs> she probably does, man. Yeah, exactly. How does this dynamic figure out? He bought the entire Kayentai from the pirates! Flip it out! She My man does business. Oh, it's them. Oh, it's just... Crane sick. Well trained. Stella Captain <laughs> Captain It couldn't have been as simple as that. Oh my god. Money talks, man. In this line of work. She's not the captain. Ah, okay. Um, they never show his face. <laughs> Why don't they just frisk him down for his money? How rich was he back then, man? The dark side of that suck him off. He's been cool that. They look hot. Who do you return them? You fair trade, man. Stole? Okay. This story is getting a bit with interest.
intro scene. Exactly. Oh, damn. What, how did this, why did this uh, beef go down? Shit, wait, much more saggy white. Look at you talking, man. Summer and water. All right, let's see what happened. She's got that knife. Shoot shoppers, suck on my done you. as you can see. Installments. Wow. <laughs> True. Sell them happiness, isn't it? This point, your father. He's gonna vomit on his face again. I knew it. I knew it. And the alcohol did it. <laughs> Just when I thought that scene was going to get serious, man. Yeah. You also told me. Oh, what? Come on. Where did that come from? <laughs> this is not going to stay funny, man. Raises the pyre. Uh, he has impressed upon her. He trades, man. Pebbles up for auction. Awesome. Oh my god. This guy can sell you anything. <laughs> oh, don't do it, man. Little Rocky, right? Here. Yeah. 
broken piece of flooring. What do you guys must? <laughs> People in captivity make their fun somehow, man. The gratitude, isn't it? She's never felt gratitude. What's this? They'd give the rations. Business. Wow, he's got his flipping face in the shade and light in it. He's gonna yeah, he uses this as a uh, take advantage. There we've got to see a bit of his face. His identity must be someone special. Kenno. Wow, look at these aliens, man. I'm on top. At least we're getting to see a bit more aliens. What happens when you have nothing left to give, man? What does a trader do when they have nothing left? That's when they flip and fight, yo. That's what how he's like. He uses diplomacy and trading up until a point. When you have nothing left to give, then you flip and fight, man. All right, let's go. Nothing, yeah. <laughs> that music, man. Sorry. All right, here we go. Second episode of the double, which ends the arc, which is the Kaintai arc. That was good, man. We finally get to see some... Not only for Sakamoto, but for flipping Mutsu as well. Hold on a second. Hold on a flipping second, yo. Alright. Uh, look, okay, there we go. Nintama. Episode 291. Come on. <laughs> This is a recap. Bloody hell, man. How did this guy get to where he is? He's got no flipping loyalty. Everyone always turns traitor in it at the most opportune moments. Like <laughs> he's the flipping admiral of this fleet right now, but his fucking sinister, devious side comes out when some crisis happens. I know people are scum, but like for people to turn scum on a dime so quickly, man. But I guess that's the nature of their business, man. Who is this guy? It seems as though they, they, they don't want us consciously. I know for comedy's sake, but they can't keep doing the vomit thing because they will lose its uh, humor. So he, they must be trying to hide that guy's face because he's someone significant. Or maybe he's not. Maybe someone we never met. But what's going to happen is... Well, actually, they've all seen his face. 
But he'll be someone significant for me. Or maybe he's just a, a MacGuffin in it to move things forward. Doesn't really matter what he looks like. He's just some generic scum admiral number seven. <laughs> This is what one criticism I had, using some people, some villains as a proxy, some villains as a tool to develop other people. Because then sometimes it just feels one dimensional. And sometimes it feels as though they, they create someone just to do something, you know, rather than letting it happen organically. We'll see, man, we'll see. Sakamoto, man, my boy. A real trade at the very end. Always leave enough room for pebbles in your bag. Wow, battle out on the seas. We've not been to the seas at all in Gintama. <laughs> I'm becoming of a trade. It's just talking like a pirate. <laughs> Yar. Oh. oh shit, here we go. Some different character designs for Amanta. Vice Commander. Where we left off that time. Walk in the plank, eh? Get to die pain as death. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Drop huge tears. Smart. You alone. Oh shit. They shot the slaves down.
you can do a change. Oh wow, look at the face. Yeah, it's all bandaged up. That's life. We've not seen Sakoa fight properly, but you know he can fight. Yeah, man. I have nothing to sell to Scumba. <laughs> There is a resolve in his eyes, yeah. Hmm. Divide value from nothing to turn a profit. How the hell did he get out of this? Oh, get Doki! Uh, so that's what happened back in the day, eh? Let's see what happened. Oh wow. Samara. Where did these ships come from? Oh, damn. He's using the judo techniques, man. <laughs> damn, she's much more powerful. Fighting star, pale skin. Is she a Yato? Yo, Yato, what the f- No wonder she wears that giant thing. Yeah. Now I'm just holding it. Why don't she, she use an umbrella then, man?
Oh my god, she actually do that. This is what I mean by Looney Tunes guys, man. <laughs> Fucking throw them at a flipping machine gun. Head first. Exactly, she held back, man. Loyalty. Maybe she can never pay that debt, but she serves him. Oh my god, look at that. Vice Captain of the Kyan Taiwan. Flipping up. The Kyan Taiwan is flipping up the slaves, yo. One of many. Pile of gems back then. Even the old timer, man. Oh, wow. That was me. That is awesome. What's on his face? 18. Ah. <laughs> it ain't gonna sell. Uh, that was awesome. It's awesome de development that his kind time made up all, all the slaves. She's got a flipping uh, colostomy bag, man. Why are their faces pixelated? <laughs> wow, she gets the last word, eh? You can't tell fleet. Slaves and their kids, probably. Labor costs. Okay, they went face first into those guns, no wonder they're flipping. Yeah. He did it for a girl. <laughs> Hmm. Eat poop, sleep poop. Hmm. Kyrates. 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 And the rest was history. She didn't wear a hat back then though. What was that about? She never wore a hat to protect her from the sun back in the day. Why was that? That was a plot hole. Let us refigure it. <laughs> Ninja. 50 million. <laughs> Pickle radishes.
That was good. That was well needed. I think if I had that like hundred episodes ago, I would have been happy with Sakamoto. But they had to space it out a bit, you know. I think this was more important to give it here because it meant something. The the commitment that people showed to Gintama to have that reward there for yeah, having his backstory. But I don't think I don't think that backstory should be a reward. I don't think that's how it should work. But I'm flipping glad we got it, man. We got filled in on Sakamoto finally. And, you know, the rest is history, as, as obviously they said. You know, there's a, quite a bit more of this episode left. Uh, let's see what's next. Wow, that is like... 18, 19, 20, 20. There's seven more minutes of the episode left, so what's going to happen after the credits? Let's see. Let's see who's going to be in the sky this time. What's hello, dude? That's my little babe praying to the sky. That's all, man. My little, my little doggy. So, oh, ah, uh, Gunsum, Gunsum from the Renho arc. <laughs> Salaru, there she is, Kaguda. There is so. Job's concern. Yeah, he left. <laughs> and a nice note of this happened. If I manage to stay on air for whole two calls. In the third course too. TV Tokyo the bitches. Shoestring budget. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Show some sincerity. <laughs> Abandon it. B and P. <laughs> Maybe a recap or something. What the hell's going on? No recap. We look like there's other shows delayed by production issues. <laughs> you are there, isn't it? Three special guests. A recap with three special guests, yeah. Oh, the female version. And he caught that sucker. Okay. Wow, that's interesting. The old me. <laughs> <laughs> Gin would be a really annoying if he was a female man, honestly. Maybe.
Cut, cut, yeah, start over then. They could have used this moment to have Hata. They could have used this moment. This is not even manga content. They could have used this. this is what I mean, yo. Sunrise could have just leveraged it. So just put him in. If Sarachi don't want to put him in, fine. Ortega. Is this Legend of the Galactic Hero? Is this something? Tribe Stars. SD Gundam. Black Tri Defeat. I don't even know that reference. It's Gundam. Recap. Salaru. Desire more. Hideyoshi. <laughs> I'm glad you are. Come on, they did go through they're literally scraping the barrel here. So if you can scrape the barrel and do the hot on it. I wouldn't mind how to just be in these little filler sections. Da, da, da. There we go. Third course. Cause. What's a cause? Course? Star Girls of Fashion. Yellow Tech Days, those who don't. So we're flashing back to the scenes in one go. Okay, this is, that's a recap flashback. Ah, right, people, thank you for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. That's weird. That's a weird decision to do that. They had to fill out an episode. I've only ever seen Gintama do that, where they cut short, but they decide, you know what, just to do it, we got to fill out the the airtime and that kind of thing. But you know what, that was brilliant. We got that Sakamoto insight. We got the Mutsu insight. We got the insight into his Kaintai. So we got basically three in one, basically every and. Heard the, the revelation she was a Yato, but then why didn't she have a flipping hat when she was uh, young to cover her from the sun? But growing up, she covers it from the sun, like Ginto was saying. But maybe that's a plot hole, maybe it isn't explained in the description box, people. Thank you for watching. We're enjoying ever close to that SAFS greatness. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed that as much as I enjoyed watching it. Thank you for watching again.